Hey guys, Captain here. So today I'm making a video that, I don't know, some of you guys might appreciate, some of you guys might find it lame. Um, it's sort of a cop-out, yeah. Because I can't actually edit any videos right now, unless I want to deal with Windows Movie Maker. No, I don't want to deal with Windows Movie Maker. Uh, because the computer I would do my editing and rendering on, uh, well, I, I might have melted it. Motherboard's fried, so that's good to know. Um, so I am... I'm hoping I get the new Sony Vegas for Christmas to use on my, uh, my new laptop. I say new. It's like a year old. Still pretty new, I guess. Um, because that thing actually is decent. Um, and, uh, so for right now I can't actually edit anything, which is fun. But I can still make this video. Um, I, I'm fortunate enough to live within reasonable distance to a Lego store. So uh, I noticed that they got some new parts in their pick-a-brick wall. I, I used a pick-a-brick wall once before. So this container cost me um, $9, I guess. And I, I tried to pack stuff pretty tightly. Not a whole lot of air in there, you know. I could get more pieces if I tried. But I really wanted to get some of these bricks, um, you know, the masonry profile bricks. Because I, I noticed that they, they had them and... Uh, I've seen them in really cool creations, and, you know, I could find good use for them, definitely. I don't know how I feel about these bricks, because it, I don't know, I, it's kind of, I would prefer walls where people have to really, you know, use some fancy techniques, or just straight up use your imagination and pretend that a wall is a brick wall. But it's, it's got its, uh, its uses, definitely, for, you know, especially castles and whatnot, uh, with this light gray, uh, it's the most common color. So, uh... Let's see what I got here. Okay, some of that flew out in all directions. They also had some of these uh, lavender 2 by one plates. I, I'm not really sure why. Oh, what's in here? Um, not really sure why. I think, I feel like Lego just has excess stock of uh, lavender and pink bricks. They added some pink bricks too. I got a couple. You never know when you need those. I have some orange bricks, but not pink, as far as I remember. Um, because it seems like a bunch of Friends sets went on sale recently. So I don't know, maybe maybe that line's not doing quite as well as they hoped. Maybe they have extra pieces. I don't know, that or they just felt like mixing up with the colors. I got a few, uh, few plates like this. A few of these, I was just thinking of filling in the gaps, and I wasn't sure how many of these I had. I could find a use. Mostly, I got three of these layers that I, uh, I packed in here like such. And this is, um, arguably the most efficient way to pack stuff in to these containers. Uh, I've seen models people have created for packing into the tall container, how to get, uh, most bang for your buck from that. And last time I went, I got 200-something pieces. Some of them were one-by-one, one, um, red translucent tiles, or plates, but, uh... Yeah, it still came out with like 200 something pieces, especially since a lot of them were 2x4 bricks. I have some of them sitting next to me. Um, so not bad at all. Some of the pieces are like very cheap. Um, but, but some of the pieces, you know, not so much. I looked this up and unless you buy it in bulk, well if you buy it in bulk you can get these for like 6 cents each. Other than that it's like 7 cents and up. So, um, you know, it's pretty good deal for me, especially since, you know, if, you, if you're talking about sets, you're generally averaging like 10 cents to the piece, unless you're dealing with like the creator line. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna count it up here, see how many pieces I got. Let's check it out. Um, yes, I'm, I'm gonna make you watch this, because I'll find something to talk about. I'll pretty much talk about the future of videos, I guess. Uh, so I'm just gonna organize all these bricks into piles together. Try to fill in extra space with more of these lavender tiles. Um, so it's been just under two years of the channel, which is pretty cool, I guess. Uh, I think Christmas Eve? That sounds that sounds about right. That sounds like when I started the channel. Uh, should be the, the two-year two year mark. Um, and it's been going pretty well. I'm... I didn't really expect the po LEGO Pokemon videos to be quite as popular as they are. Even some of my card game stuff um, has been really popular. 
I do want to make some more Magic the Gathering videos. I Well, I say more, but I guess I want to make some Magic the Gathering videos. Because uh, I've been playing that a lot recently. Um, I went to a Friday Night Magic at a local hobby store recently. Hobby comic store. Um, and, and so that's a lot of fun. I think I'm going to start going there regularly. I, pr I have a bunch of, like crappy, like, welfare decks that I put together from this, um, this builder's toolkit I got for, like, $20. It's, like, the M14 corset thing, and then, uh, and then I have some random commons that I acquired, plus the one, like, theme deck that I started with. Uh, oh, oh, and, uh, I bought singles for two, like, really cheap, kind of fun, gimmicky decks. So that's a good time. I lost, like, my first three matches going 0 and 2 last night, but um, but I actually won the last one, so that was fun. I was running some some crappy little mill deck. Anyone here who who's not here for the sake of like Captain Hobby videos is like, all right, what what are you talking about? Um, right, but let's start let's start counting up what we've got here. Again, I can't edit videos right now, so I have to just fill time. I can't be like, and we cut away, but you know, um. Let's put these in stacks of four. How about that? The plates are going to be substantially terrible to count. Oh man, I'm not looking forward to that. But uh, the rest of this won't be too hard. Alright, so let's take a look at how many pieces we got here. Pretty much these plates are still a mess, but we got three lime green. 2 by 4s Set that off to the side. Four 2 by 4s in regular green. I should be writing this down. 16 1 by 4s in pink. Four of these things in black. Uh, the modified plates. Just grabbing a pencil. Don't mind me. 3 plus 4 plus 16 plus 4 plus 4 of these gray 4x4 four four, uh, plates plus um, alright how do we efficiently figure out how many bricks this is alright I guess I'll count all the loose ones first I'm hoping I, I'm over I should definitely be over a hundred of these bricks if I'm over 200 bricks total, that would be nice. Oh, I probably will because of these pieces. So let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 single bricks there. Um, see how many sets of two I've got stuck together here. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. I was about to say, why is it working out to be a non-divisible by 3 number? What I did with these, I placed them in like this. There's a couple couple things you can do here, but if you're, if you're taking these kinds of brick, this is one of the most efficient ways. You can also use 2 by 2s kind of sideways. Maybe not even sideways, maybe it was vertically, but... So, alright, 21 of those, that's another 42, puts me up to 56 so far. This is looking good. If I got like 120 of these, I pretty much broke even on the on the container, actually. Mm, like 130. Okay, this was one brick together. So this is gonna be 4, 8, 12... And this is going to be another, um, it should be also 8, right? Yeah, 20, so I'm up to 76. This thing is, uh, 3, 3, 10, 16, so that's, uh, 92. And now to count these, alright, let's see, so 4, 8, did I? Oh, why did I count that as fun? Oh, never mind. Yeah. 4, 8, 10, 10, 10, 10, 2. 
Okay, so let's, let's count this, what, five layers of ten? All right, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five layers of ten plus four. So that's going to be another 54. That puts me up to 146, right? I'm keeping track of that in my head, right? Let's rearrange this a bit for easier math. Um, so that's very nice. Wow, this is like cheaper than if I'd bought them online. Um, which, yes, is how I get most of my pieces. Sometimes people ask me that. Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and is this 10 or 12? Okay, this is 10. And, um, so 60 plus another 6, 66. Is that, is that 212? Right? Yeah, wow. That is a lot of bricks. That is really nice. I I almost feel like I screwed up my arithmetic there. That's, wow. That's like 14 bucks worth of them. That's pretty sick. So, I'm gonna have to double check that later. 212, not bad. And then, time to count these nightmares. A few of them I double stacked. Three, four, five, six. There's 12 there. And then, let's see. 16, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, plus 85, wow. All right, let's take a look at what that is. All right, three, four, seven, plus 16, 23, 31, 243, plus 85, 328. Wow, that is really nice. 328 bricks, or pieces, I guess, for $9 including about 200 that are worth like 14 bucks when we ordered online. That is a really solid haul. Definitely cannot complain about that. So um, pretty much what I did to pack them in, I, I kind of showed off earlier, I showed what I did with the um, little stacks like this, and then I made big layers like this. I obviously, you'll notice I rearranged it, but I made layers like this, and I you can stick three layers in like this, and. There's like a way you can figure out what's the best, but I just kind of did trial and error over and over and then I filled in the gaps with uh, little purple ones or sometimes I'd stick them on like the underside of their room uh, with you know little plates like that and then on top I put a layer of plates again that's where I put the um, put these and some more purple ones and these four and um, and even on top of that use the lid now I could have tried and put some uh, purple bricks here like the or purple plates here like this, but like, I don't know what I'm going to do with this mini. They're not really purple, they're lavender, I guess, but uh, like I don't know what I'm going to do with this mini. And uh, and and when I tried to put it on top, they, they slipped out. And it's just an inconvenience. But um, Lego stores shouldn't yell at you for doing this. This, as far as I'm concerned, like they're okay with it. So, because you're, you're buying bulk bricks from the store. Plus, what, what like interest really do the employees have? Like they don't. So no one's going to yell at you for doing this kind of thing. I've done it before. Again, I got somewhere in like the like 230, 250 bricks. Not bad considering, again, these are, one of these is like four of these. So, um, you know, it's a solid haul. Also got a lot of plant stems wherever I put those. Um, so anyway, this, this video is long, but you know what? It's, you might not see another video for a little while. So um, anyway, if you like this video, please uh, rate, comment, subscribe. I send it to your friends, I guess. Check out my other ones. I'll see you guys next time, and uh, have a happy holidays.